Welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today I'm back with another hair review. Today's video is sponsored by Beauty Forever Hair. They were kind enough to send me over this cute closure unit that I decided to do a little bang look with, but we'll get into that later. It turned out so cute though. But yeah, I've worked with them before. I'll link the video that I did with one of their units before. So their units are nothing new to me, but I'm not gonna do a whole lot of talking. We're gonna jump right into the video. I'm gonna start with the unboxing as always. So let's just get into it. All right, so this is what the box looks like right on top is your wig it comes inside of a clear ziploc bag this is a body wave closure unit in 24 inches it's a four by four lace closure unit and 180 percent density and then at the bottom of the box they have this little organza bag full of goodies they sent some lashes the nude wig cap and a cute little bandana or paisley print whatever you want to call it scarf so you could tie that around your head you could tie your edges down with it you can tie it around and wear as like like a fashion scarf type of thing but yeah that's what they sent so this is what the wig looks like straight out of the bag it comes inside of a hairnet and there's also stuffing on the inside this is the construction like i said it's a four by four lace closure it's got some lace in the back and it's got two combs in the front a comb in the back and an adjustable strap and y'all see the beautiful body wave pattern and then this is what the hairline and the knots look like straight out the box without doing anything to them i ended up bleaching these knots but i didn't pluck the unit because i knew i was doing bangs so it wasn't any sense in me plucking the unit but um yeah i don't think i took a video of after i bleached the knots but y'all know what wigs look like after you bleach the knots so you know it's all right but yeah that's the unboxing so now we're gonna get into the install portion of the video when i started the install this was like four or five days ago i'm just now finishing up the video today four or five days later but in the middle of the install i had somewhere to be i didn't have time to show y'all me straightening it i just quickly ran through it with the straightener before i left to where i had to be so i didn't get a chance to show y'all me styling it the day i actually actually installed it so I showed y'all the styling part today that's what I finished filming today and then as well as the intro and outro and all that so yeah you see it jump to like I'm wearing something different I'm wearing this shirt after I installed it that's why because it's four or five days later and I just now got a chance to film the styling part and the review portion and everything like that so that's what you're gonna see next so yeah let's get into the install and styling portion
All right, y'all, so um, I wanted to do bangs with this wig, so I'm about to cut them. Hopefully I don't screw it, cause it looks really good like this already, but I want bangs. I'm gonna part out some hair. I don't want no thick bang either. I hate seeing people with thick bangs. Like, what are you doing? So I'm gonna hot comb this downward. So they're going in this direction. Hot comb this, the rest of this back. So it can stay out the way. Hopefully I'm doing this right. I've never cut bangs before. I had bangs when I was in middle school. If I can find a picture, I'll insert it. Please don't laugh y'all cause I don't know what I was thinking. But I had bangs with my real hair once upon a time. Haven't had them since then. Okay, let me stop parting out here before it be too thick and I'll be done screwed it. Move this hair out of the way. I think it looks good though, so far. Okay, so I think this is enough hair. So I'm gonna cut. Okay, here we go. Where are my scissors? Whew. Okay. So this is what I cut. Oh Lord. Oh, this looks, oh. Girl, this looks good. Let me bump it. I need my smaller flat iron. Hold on, because that is too big. It looks good already. Like, it's not too thick. It's like perfect. Okay, I look cute. Okay, this is perfect. This is exactly how thin I wanted them. It's good to start out thin anyway, because you can always add more hair, but you can't take away. So if you cut them too thick the first time, you're just screwed. I feel like I cut them the perfect length too. I don't I don't think I need to go back and trim it up. My little tiny flat iron. And it's like little dry bits of got to be spray in here. Is it got to be spray or is it this wax stick that I used earlier? So if you see that, that's what that is. How cute. That is so cute. And it's not like two in my eyes, but it's not too short. You know, I don't like that either when people get bangs and like you can't even see their face. Like what's going on? So this don't look good. I'm gonna do anything else to it. I think it looks good. I think it looks good like this. I'm not gonna mess with it anymore before I mess it up. Mm, so cute. All right, y'all, so that was the install and styling portion. Did I not do that? Did it not turn out so good? Like, it looks so good. I'm really proud of the bangs. I don't like a thick bang. I, I just hate that. I don't like people do that. I don't like seeing it. So I went for more of this kind of look with my bangs. I didn't want them to be super thick. Like, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I'm talking about. I, I hate that. I hate people have super thick bangs. This is how I like my bangs to look. So yeah, and it turned out perfect. The first cut didn't have to do nothing else. So yeah, I really like it. I'm really proud of how it turned out. So so let me give y'all my thoughts on the unit. I've had it in for four or five days now before I styled it today. I've been wearing it straight, no bangs, nothing ever since I installed it. But I decided to cut the bangs and everything today because that's how I initially wanted to wear it. I just didn't have time to do it the day I installed it. So let me give y'all my thoughts. So off rip, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10, okay? I didn't have no issues with this wig at all. Like it's perfect all the way around. I did a glueless install. I've been doing glueless installs lately just cause I get sick of having to get bow hold off. And then I've been wearing wigs for almost a year now straight. I got braids one time in between. Yeah, I feel like that's just not good to keep doing um, on my hairline or whatever. That's not good on my hairline. I'm not gonna go bald for nobody, so. Um, I've been doing glueless installs, glueless. I've just been using got to be spray. It's not lace glue, it's just hairspray. So yeah, the install went by really well. The lace got it to match perfectly to my skin tone. Didn't struggle getting it to match at all. It fits. Y'all know I have a big head, so it's big head friendly. I didn't struggle to get it on at all. And I love closure units. I'm starting to love closure units because when I tend to have issues with units, it's with lace frontals. And it's because the hairlines on the sides don't be low enough. And it's like, you know, like it's hard to get it past my hairline for whatever reason. 
closure units, I tend to never have that problem. So yeah, didn't have any issues with it fitting. It's 24 inches, like I said, and it's definitely giving that. Let me stand up, I am 5'3", and this is where it stops at on me so yeah definitely given 24 inches the density is 180 percent density and is definitely given that it is not thin at all whatsoever it's not thin at all and y'all know i don't do thin so no issues there it's like a perfect density it's not thin anywhere like nowhere throughout this wig is it thin not the ends or nothing so yeah i really like the density on it it's super soft it doesn't tangle a lot like i've had this in like i said for about four or five days now and it doesn't really tangle and i've slept in it and everything i really don't get a whole lot of tangles when i have to brush it out the next day or when i wake up and go somewhere I really don't get that many tangles um shedding isn't much of a problem it barely sheds if at all it's just a bomb unit 10 out of 10 like i said i don't have nothing else to say it's nothing to say you can see it for yourself okay it's 10 out of 10 it gave me zero problems zero and that's rare on this channel um i've had a couple of 10 out of 10s before but yeah this unit is perfect so i really highly recommend that you purchase this unit and it is a body wave unit but i decided to straighten it i wanted to wear it straight but you can wear it in like the body wave style or curl it you know body wave wigs tend to hold a curl better than straight ones so that's a plus as well but i decided to straighten it but yeah that's all i got to say i highly recommend you purchase this unit like this is a bomb unit y'all know i'm not lying for no company i'm gonna tell y'all like it is i'm gonna tell you what it is and what it ain't i'm not gonna have y'all spending y'all money on some units that ain't about nothing so yeah if you want to purchase this unit which you should the link will be in the description box below. And don't forget to use the code DECE10 to get $10 off of your order. I think that's it. That's all I got to say, y'all. Make sure you check out my website, whoshebeauty.com, where I sell my lashes, my big blinks, which are my 25 millimeter lashes, and my baby blinks, which are my shorter lashes for my natural girls. I'm currently wearing one of my big blinks, which is a part of my new series, my fluffy series. They are big blinks, just fluffier. And I'm wearing the style Prada. So go shop my lashes. I also sell lip gloss I make myself, my lip candies, which are my tinted glosses. I have a Juicy Watermelon, which is a red tint, Georgia Peach, which is a peachy tint, and Cocoa Kisses, which is what I'm wearing right now, which is a brown tint, all super moisturizing. If you're not a fan of the tinted glosses, I also have regular clear gloss. I have Strawberry Kiwi, which is the regular clear gloss, and then I have Diced Pineapples, which is the clear glitter gloss. I also sell bags. I have the Crystal Money bags. I have Spring Me bags. I have Rhinestone face mask. COVID is not gone at all, so stay masked up. You can be cute with it and get you a Rhinestone one. So yeah, I go shop my face mask. I also sell press-ons I make myself. You can shop any designs that I have on my website or you can do my business page on Instagram who she beauty and we can discuss a custom order over there I do accept custom orders I also sell jewelry necklaces anklets I sell sweat sets I sell handmade velvet do rags and I also sell lash tweezers so if you have trouble applying your lashes I used to struggle with that for the longest and even after I got the hang of it I still use them it just made the process go by faster and easier for me in my opinion so yeah if you struggle putting on your lashes this is what you need once you get your lashes from me get you a pair of lash tweezers on your way out and i believe that's everything on my website so yeah make sure you check my website whoshebeauty.com link in the description as well as the link to my business page on instagram whoo that always takes so much out of me when i have to do that well that's it for this video y'all thank you again to beauty forever hair for sponsoring this video and that's all i got for y'all today thank you for watching my video i hope you all enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe to your girl channel please and thank you and make sure your post notifications are on so you don't ever Miss when I post because you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. So make sure your post notifications are on and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.